Uh, we're joined by Erica from our team here. Erica, who's worked on yeah. the show for many, many years. Erica, good morning. Yes. Good on morning. our Zoom, how you doing? Oh, just dandy, you know, yeah. in, on my bed as we speak. <laughs> Where is your home? What part of LA? Los Feliz. And how has it been in Los Feliz? That's usually a thriving neighborhood. Oh my, it's just silent. Usually our street, we have like bars and restaurants at the end of our street. So usually there's people, there's like so much foot traffic. There's just not anymore. What's the place I love in Los Feliz? It's been there a long time. Mm. You walk in, they have pizza. Uh, it, it, what's it called? It, Don, uh, Don. Do, Don. Oh, Lil Doms. Lil Doms. Lil Doms. Lil Doms. Lil that place Doms. rocks. Yeah. That place is amazing. I mean, Lil Doms. You got to support Lil Doms through it all. Mm -hmm. That it's it's charming. They have and take so home good. pizza kits. Like oh. you can make your own pizza at home with their oh, kit. I love that. Yeah. Well, hello to Lil Dom. <laughs> uh, all right, Erica. You are taking a 30-day course. When I heard about this, I think Tanya may be signing up for this as well. But tell us about mm -hmm. this 30-day yep. course you're taking and why you're taking. Um, so it's a 30-day. It's completely free. And it's by this woman named Rachel Cargill. And one of my friends sent it to me kind of when everything was happening with, I mean, the Black Lives Matter movement. And it basically is for white women to become allies for Black women because it became very clear that a lot of us did not know enough about what we weren't doing. Um, mm -hmm. And so it's been, I'm only on day eight of 30. So it's been pretty educational so far. It kind of started with like the history of just our country. Uh, and then it goes into like recognizing privilege and like why we need to be allies. Um, and it's really eye opening. And there's things about it that are like uncomfortable. I know Tanya's about to start it. So get ready. Mm -hmm. But it's been amazing and I feel like I'm learning to just recognize where I can be better and just be more aware of other people who aren't exactly like me. Would you have thought about taking this course before everything that's happened over the last handful of weeks? I would have never been like, you know what, I should spend my mm -hmm. like very little spare time learning about others. And so I'm really, I know that there's like a lot going on, but I'm glad that it kind of opened my eyes to doing something like yeah. this. And Tanya, you're going to yeah. sign up for this or you're about to start? Um, I signed up for it already. I, I started reading White Fragility, so I want to finish that and then I'm going to do the course. I but even starting that, that. I ordered that. Even <laughs> starting that book was... How did you get the book? They told me it was sold out. I had to get a used one, but I still haven't gotten it yet. It's on Audible. Audible. Oh, I don't yeah. know how to do that. <laughs> I can teach you. It's super easy. But even I'm only on chapter two. And even in that, I, I realized the same thing with Erica. Like, I'm totally a part of the problem. This whole time, I thought I'm not the problem. And I'm 100% a part of it. And it yeah. kind of is deconstructing the way that I thought about things in the past. Now, the course was created by Rachel Cargill. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's and Rachel dot Cargill on Instagram and all her infos there. And why is she doing the course? Um, well, she created it a while ago, actually. It wasn't just now, but she is like an activist. She has multiple other businesses, I guess. She has like a bookstore that sells a lot of like black authors books. And she also has therapy. Um, it's called the Loveland Foundation. And it's, it's therapy for people of color who aren't, you know, supported in other ways. So she's been Very doing cool. this for a long time. Do you yeah. usually take a test and an exam at the end? Uh, well, oh. I don't know. I haven't gotten to the well, end. <laughs> if Rachel's listening now, I suggest you implement a really, really intense exam at the end. Yeah. Of the yes. uh, no pressure. Well, that's great. I'm glad that uh, you found that. Thanks for sharing that. I'm glad you're doing okay. Hang in there in Los Feliz and you take care. Okay, Erica? All right. You too. Right. Bye-bye. So at Rachel.C-A-R-G-L-E on Instagram, if you want to check that out.